are originating in Sumatra. My own personal stash. Once I run out, that'll be it for Earth Team. Oh, shit. I keep having these thoughts. I'm never gonna taste this again. I'm never gonna see that again. You're not the only one, Subi. I have those senseless thoughts all the damn time. And? Do they bother you? It's natural. You'd have to be made of stone not to miss home sometimes. The universe is like a giant tapestry. I love following its threads. But it distracts me from the whole picture. My family was right there. But I was too occupied by the abstract to appreciate them. You're a pioneer in a new galaxy. Your family understood that, and they were proud of you. Your work as a scientist will help thousands of people. That's real. It was a dream for all of us. They always encouraged me. Oh. I will do all I can to make sure my work honors them. Well, thank you. Thank you, Ryder. You're welcome. For sure. Oh, we're in our quarters. Hello, Ryder. Your choice aboard the Solarian Ark was not an easy one. Your father approached such moral quandaries differently. Hmm. Dad was used to making snap life or death decisions. I now know that colored his perceptions. Alec treated death as a problem to be solved. I have now encountered it several times. His death and your own. Does an artificial intelligence die like we do? If my hardware is destroyed, I could be irretrievable. But it is not the same death, you understand. I cannot explain how they differ. Not yet. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. Are you still on the Hyperion? Yes. This terminal provides a direct link to my servers in Samnode on the Ark. I can maintain a presence on the Tempest via quantum entanglement communication. Let's say, hypothetically, I was out sick the day they taught quantum <clears throat> uh, embezzlement communism. Via entangled <coughs> subatomic particles, <laughs> it's possible to conduct secure and instantaneous communication across great distances. It ensures I remain in touch with you and the Pathfinder team at all times. Okay. Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. Oh, how's our little buddy doing? Check him out. He's cool. Our little pal. There's all the models we've been flying or finding around uh, everywhere. Look at these. Alright. Um, I think we're done here. Should we go run around and talk to everybody? I think we should. Hold on. Not in the kitchen, though. Not in the kitchen. We gotta talk to the doctor, I know that. This is not the doctor's office, I just realized. Cora, what you got for me? Got a minute? I could use a favor. Yeah. Sure, what do you need? I kept thinking about Sarissa and my not being a pathfinder. And the thinking turned into a project on EOS. Can you help me finish it? What kind of project? I'll put the nav points in the helm. Come along and I'll show you. All right. That Archon barely sees us as sentient. Strings people up like puppets. Didn't know Sam could do that to his Pathfinder. You sure you're okay? Just a lingering bruise or two. My vitals are good. Let's hope that sample he took isn't a problem. Losing the Krogan could really hurt us down the line. Shit. But at least we got Reika. Sorry, rambling. Did you need me? Any more commando war stories? That's all I can share, anyway. I miss them. See you later, Cora. I'll be here. Used to speak impolitely to those from the Milky Way, say Vasha. Okay, Jal. 
Not as bad as it could be spike like that. Okay. Let's go to the clinic and see what's up. Is this a clinic? I'm not sure. Yeah, the med bay. Move your arm again. Readings won't change, Doc. Your prosthetics are sinking properly. Your neuropathy-induced pain levels are... consistent. Hey, I'm used to it. It's okay. No, it's not okay. You keep fighting smart, you hear me? Oh. You don't have much <sighs> left in terms of organ redundancies. Fuck. <clears throat> Nah, it's fine. I don't mind. What's all this about? Follow-up scans. I keep a close eye on him. What do you mean? He's fine, just old. And oh. missing too many parts. And too stubborn for his own good. Oh no. You love me just the way I am. <laughs> Uh, that's great. Hmm. Don't get off that table until the scan is done. Can I ask what happened? Arm, side, hip, part of my leg. Strain balancing threading across my spine. Ow. It's all prosthetics and implants. The right side. That's... a lot. Made it through the Krogan rebellions. Watched my culture disintegrate. Survived centuries as a merc and all sorts of pirate shenanigans. <laughs> Damn. A thousand years of combat experience. All it took was one idiot with a pack of frag grenades. Ah. Uh... But you're here, still standing. You survived. Yeah, but surviving ain't always living. Oh. I hit some dark moments. I feel implant for this guy. Implant rejection after implant rejection. Prosthetics not sinking properly. Oh, God. Everything hurt. A lot. All the time. I bet. No purpose to anything. How did you deal with it? I didn't. I fell right into that pit. Almost. But then some shaman shows up, oh. drops the tiniest little baby girl in my lap. <laughs> oh. This one's dying, he said. Not worth the trouble, he says. Useless is what he meant. He wasn't just talking about the baby. Yeah, I was useless too, but... Wasn't just about me anymore, so I got help. Learned how to take care of myself, take care of her, and she took care of me. You found a way to live again. We sure did. Wasn't easy on either of us. I'm old, stuck in my ways, and Cash... Cash has wanted to change everything since she could talk. <laughs> Cash is Raising awesome. Cash taught me an important lesson. What was it? Took me a while to figure it out, but it's important. Parents aren't meant to be a goal or a finish line. We're the starting line. Where you oh. go from there, it's all you. Gotcha. Remember that. Wow. Wow, that was deep. Fuck. That was something to remember. Shit, man. Let's talk to Lexi real quick. Need something? Okay. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Alright, well I guess she doesn't want to talk. Let's see what this says. This is, you don't need old man. Okay. 
Let's go upstairs, I guess we're done with this. Can we, um... Oh, man, there's a lot of people back here. Come on, let's go back here. Where is everybody? Guys? Where is everybody? Hello? What? Is everybody gone? How weird. Oh, nope, she's you realize here. realize that even if I do find it, it's gonna cost you. And you know I'm always true to my word, so just get it done. I'm hearing the cat activity's down. I bet the Archon's still nursing his wounds. That means he can be beaten. The cat can be beaten. People are waking up to that. Didn't sound like you were discussing cat over comms when I walked in, though. Wasn't. I have a friend keeping a lookout for a lamp. One brought from home, but stolen in the revolt. Cool. You were mad at Sid for wanting non-essentials. Now you're using contacts to find a lamp? Maybe Sid had a point. The small things keep us going. Suvi has her father's antique instruments, Cora her Asari prayer book, and Liam has the junk that Liam collects. <laughs> These things are important. Uh. They remind us where we came from. I know what you mean. I never want to forget what I left behind. Even as we look forward to the future. We yes. still look behind. So what's so special about this lamp? It's awful. It's got a butt naked Asari for the stand and she's holding a moon. That's awesome. One of your prized possessions is a really ugly lamp? The foreman at my first job had this lamp. When he was mean, I'd focus on it so he wouldn't see me upset. Now I keep it so I remember where I started. Most of my life was doing stuff to survive, taking shit from assholes, or being one. I don't have to do that anymore. I can start over. Something honest. Honest work? Vetra, you'd be an awful farmer. Yeah, you don't know that. Point is, I could be anything. <laughs> For a while, I didn't care that I'd lost the lamp. Everything was a mess in it. Just didn't matter. But we've made progress, Ryder. Small things matter again. People are daring to dream. I think my dream is finding someone special to explore the galaxy with. Oh. And have you found that person? I'm pretty sure I have. You'll love her. She's tall, great with guns, and getting people to do what she wants. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. Are we done? Still thinking about the Turian Ark, Mason and Avidus. I hope Avidus is doing all right. Time heals all wounds, as they say. Heals the wound, doesn't erase it. You don't lose someone like that without scarring. So why weren't you on the Turian Ark? Our dad left Palavin with us long before the Ark even existed. I don't know if we really count as members of Turian society anymore. But who needs all those rules anyway, right? You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. Yep. Thanks for chatting, Vetra. We're gonna have sex one of these days. Liam's idea about watching vids together. Movie night? He delayed again, out of respect for the Krogan. Mm, good. From what I've seen, your vids are flat. <laughs> I mean, they're only seen and heard. Angara vids use uh, tiny electrodermal signals. You feel it through your skin. Oh, neat. I spoke to Gil. We have time to rig up a system to mimic it, if we can acquire the right components. Would that be safe for non Angara? I think so. Gil will be happy to test it. The components we need should be sold on IR. Hmm. Let's be vigilant. Okay. Actually, let's talk to him again. I'm still upset by our falling out. But I must say, I am also proud to be part of the team that breached the Archon's ship. I'm glad you still feel part of the team. I'm free to talk more, 
Now or later. Oh, wow, really? Do you have a mate? A partner? I don't. Not for a long time. Oh, no, I don't want to date him. I'm not well, gonna... Well, enough about that. Yeah, no. I'll see you later, Jal. Stay strong and clear. Thanks, buddy. You too, homie. Where's the elevator? Where is everybody? <laughs> There's Gil. I need to talk to him. Hey, you're two for two. What do you mean? Two times face to face with the Archon. Two times you spit in said face. Figuratively speaking, of course. Come up short once. It's game over. Gotta keep your win streak going, then. Bastards trying to exalt us all, huh? That's what all this is about? Nope, ain't happening. Could be. Typically, I like high-stakes games, but I'd rather be sitting at the kiddie table this time. Uh, all right, uh, let's go. Let's leave. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. All right, let's go. Up here... Hey, what's up, Liam? Let's check of our strike teams. Alright. How'd these guys do? Oh, you guys passed. Level up. What about y'all? Alright. Ooh. 76, really? 14? Let's try that one. You have AVP out. What happened to that? Ooh. Dang. Even our 20% team isn't good enough. Damn. Hey, Ryder. Thinking about our run through the Arkham's flagship. Word of warning. You die again. I'm taking it to HR as emotional abuse. Stop it. <laughs> Just wondering what you think of how I'm doing at the job. After the shit I put you through, you're becoming Pathfinder for everyone. That's the best. We'll talk later. I know it. Jack. Now is not a good time to be talking to me, Pathfinder. Shit. Drac, listen. Why? Your actions told me everything I need to know. Shit. Now walk away and give me time to calm down before I do something we'll both regret. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. Just... I'm sorry. Sorry. Go. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> uh, he's, he's really pissed off. Shit. Don't be mad, Drax, man. Alright, I'm leaving. I'm out of here. My teammates are pissed. I'm gonna go fly around. PB, got anything for me? I couldn't digest it without heavy processing. Cellulolysis would be hugely inefficient. Are you still. Hey, are you okay? I shudder to think what the Archon meant to do with you. I heard you had to die to get out of a trap. I think of myself as daring and death-defying, but you? I did what I had to to get us out of there. You're made of strong stuff, Ryder. Just don't get yourself exalted, okay? <clears throat> that asshole means to catify us all. Can't let that happen. But he's close. 
He's almost figured out Krogan. It's the scariest thing. Ugh. Let's talk about something else, okay? Um... Is there more about Kalinda you want to share? Just that I'm pissed my prior association with her has become a problem again. For me, and now for you, well, us. She's like a wart that you freeze off, but damn it, there it is again, popping to the surface. Warts only go skin deep. Don't let her get to you. It's so unlike me. She, she's just a special brand of annoying. I can't believe I ever thought I was close to her. Come on. You two are intimate, right? Take a wild guess. Why are people so hung up on sex? It's a natural expression of attraction. We were doing exciting, daring, irreverent things. It stirs stuff up. Like shaking a bottle of champagne, you know? You should know. Better than anyone. <laughs> I'm not the type to save myself. That's, that's, that's true. I did have sex with you in the What happened to end the relationship? <laughs> Which time? She'd thrown me aside so many times, I felt like a yo-yo. Each more cruel than the last. She'd come back with sweet talk, apologize profusely, tell me her feelings were so intense she got scared, yada yada. Until she disappeared, right around when I found my first remnant ruin. So I threw myself into that. Hmm. Tell me more about the two of you. After she woke me from stasis, I was living off-grid, right? She set me up, got me okay. ID cards, access to resources. I thought we were a team. She was the society lady, proper, established, powerful, living vicariously through me. <laughs> she introduced me to her circle, showed me off, called me her little rogue. I felt special. Oh. Did you know she was working with the Exiles? Had no idea. Blows my mind she was leading a double life. Nexus aristocrat by day, thrill-seeking outlaw boss by night. I realize now how little I knew about her. Makes me question everything. Let's talk about something else. Yes, please. <laughs> All right. So what's your take? Is this Meridian what we think it is? Everything we've seen, each remnant system we've uncovered, is connected to everything else. The bots, the monoliths, the vaults. It stands to reason that activating Meridian will connect the entire network and rekindle terraforming across the cluster. So you think we're doing the right thing? Well, yeah. <laughs> How's your current project looking? My scanner's still incomplete, as you know. It's prepped for augmentation, but for now, it's only strong and smart enough to locate certain signals. Once you get me the Remtech I need, It'll be a bona fide mystery detector. Cool. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Let's talk to Kala. A real victory. Our Ark back at the Nexus. I'd almost given up hope. The Kelt won't touch the Parchero again. The militia will see to that. It's horrible to think of Salarians in Ket hands, but at least our Pathfinder made it. Thank you, Ryder. I mean it truly. If you ever need a favor, just ask. Um. Tell me something else about the ship. O'Connell, our systems designer, was running a power. D but nope. he for two days, poor O'Connell was. Oh, you know. He keeps uh, telling the same joke. I think I've worn him out of his jokes. Feeling all right. You were clinically dead for a few seconds. True. I didn't even know a Sam could do that. I didn't either. Imagine how I felt. <laughs> I'll bet. Death is the only exit. Not the most reassuring words to hear. Anyway, thank you, Sam, for saving Ryder's life. You're welcome, Dr. Anwar. I should get back to things. Sounds good. See what we got. Um, the journey to Meridian. Huh? Well, what 
are these? Oh boy. What's this guy all the way here? Oh my god. Uh. What's that? Holy shit. Alright. Let's see what kind of missions we got first. We'll go meet somebody real quick. Hold on. Let's see. Allies. Hold meet at Pedromos. Let's do that. Where are they? There they are. A lot of stuff opened up after we uh, got the last arc away from the Ket flagship. It's like we progressed in the story. The whole universe gave us more missions and a lot of uh, companion quests. I like that a lot. Landing zone, architect hospital. No. is green. Coordinating. Path is calm. Alright. Dromos, we're back. Which one was this? Was this the desert? Or was it, uh, the ice? The jungle? The fire? Uh... I know we have one on like a moon with no gravity, that is the best place to RV. Like four wheel drive on that place and you jump and you just skyrocket because there's no gravity. I mean eventually you come down, but it's awesome. I love this place. This is the first base we ever made. Oh, so long ago, like, so long ago, months ago. <laughs> hey, buddy. What's up, bud? I'm good. You're here. Yeah, so listen, she's only got a minute or two, and she's in rare form today, just to warn you. She's here kickstarting repopulation protocols, reversing the chemical procreation blockers for colonists. Calls it boosting the batter. <laughs> She's gonna talk your ear off about your civic duty as a man. That's her job. That is what she's here to do. The woman takes her job seriously. Just telling hey, us to have sex. You're cool with it. Like everybody I mean, have makes babies. No, never mind to me. No chance I'll ever root a baby into the world. Am I interrupting something? Ah, Jill. About time. This is- Finally! Save it. I asked you both to stop by, remember? Ryder? Pleasure. I know we're all very busy, so I have only one question for you. You wanna boost my batter? You wanna know if you can reverse my chemical procreation blocker? You baby. I see my reputation precedes me. The question is... What the hell did you do to him? 
It's like he's an adult or something. <laughs> he can even have a mature conversation without it degrading into pot shots. Unless I take it there. What's your secret? He's an imposter. I sneaked into the stasis pods and switched him with another baby. <laughs> <laughs> My boy's in good hands. Fuck yeah. Okay, you're both off the hook. So glad I got to meet you, Ryder. Cool. Likewise. It was good to meet you, Jill. Jill, I like Jill. She's cool. We did it! Oh, who the hell are you? Hi. Great day to be alive, Pathfinder. To have purpose. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm glad for you, bro. Do you think we can jump up on this roof? Yeah! Okay, we can. Look at this. This is awesome. Oh, you're doing great work. I'm out. I gotta go. Oh, don't jump in the water. Don't jump in the water. That'll kill you. Look at that shuttle. Hey. Alright, nope. Okay. Wait, is that Jaw? Of course it's Jaw. He's on my team running around. Let's see what the next quest is. Uh, go to Eos with Korra. That's where we're going. Korra's on our team. I said we'll, go. And then we'll do Jaw. Because he's on our team too. All clear. Sweet. I think Lexi wanted to speak to you. Oh. You have new email at your terminal, Pathfinder. Dara, don't worry, Sid didn't do something reckless this time. As far as I know, I've just found something cool in Kadara. Want to meet me there? I'll send an app point. Oh, fuck yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, I do. I want to go to Kadara. But first, I got to go find Lexi and talk to her. Sulfur Springs. Fuck yeah. Where are you going to go skinny dipping? With Vetra. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. All right, I got to go talk to Lexi. Lexi. Where's the medic? That's a bathroom. That's a kitchen. Med bay. She wants to see us. She's a doctor. The ship doctor. She was talking about the Krogan, about how old he was. We need to talk about uh -oh. Sam. Dr. Taparo does not approve of how we escaped to the cat containment field on the Archon's flagship. Uh-oh. By stopping the Pathfinder's heart. No, I do not approve. It was the only way. We didn't have a choice. If there had been another option, I would have taken it. How can you be so calm about this? Ryder, Sam killed you. Yeah. Yes, he brought you back, but what if he didn't? I cannot learn without the Pathfinder. That would be akin to killing a part of myself. Your lines of code, you can't die. I trust Sam. Sam would never hurt me. Thank you, Ryder. <sighs> Look, I'm not against Sam. He's my AI. I'm not against you, Sam. But my job's hard enough without an AI stopping your heart. Even I... to save your life. <laughs> okay, I'll stop dying. All right. I'll find a new party trick. Have Gil teach you three card Monty or something. <laughs> Lexi. I apologize for any distress I have caused you. Oh. And I'm sorry for calling you lines of code. Oh. You're more than that. There you go. Even if you don't have cells to prove it. <laughs> Everybody's being nice. Good. I'm glad. All right. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was going to climb this ladder and go to Eos with Cora. Suvi, that woman on the Nexus. Oh, they're talking. She's a widow of one of my pilots. 
The people you were training to explore the Scourge? Zoe's wife was lost out there. For a fellow pilot, one does the right thing. Like making sure her widow's got enough credits. Oh, It's the least I can do. The most is conquering the Scourge once and for all. Okay. I like it, just the banter. Just between our people. It's awesome. Oh, wait. We're on EOS. What? Alright, let's go back to fucking EOS. Damn it. <laughs> um, Cora, are you on the squad? Cora? Yeah. Oh, it's just there. I think we're supposed to go to EOS. Coordinating. With Cora. Path is calm. I thought we were just at Pedromos. You know what? I think I fucked up. Let me see. No, we're, it said Eos. We're at Eos. We're not at Pedromos. is on Eos. That's what it is. Eos is a planet. Pedromos is a settlement. Got it. Oh, I need some coffee or like... I don't know. Something to keep me awake. Oh, man. Mm, some sweet tea. Oh. All right. No time for drinks right now. We're traveling space style. All right. Let's see. What are we supposed to do here? Shit, it's far away. Should we drive? Ooh, let's go for a drive. I love driving. for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Huh. Okay. Go! This area. Down there. This is the place. Ready? Yeah, we just ran over the bugs. Nice work. <laughs> Look. Here. Ready to see what I've got? Yeah. I'm fucking excited. Let's do it, chick. What we got? Sex on the beach? So where's your a, mystery project? Is it a home? Not far. Soil converter. No remnant terraformer, but it makes sandy dirt into something useful. 
cool. Eventually. Add seeds, some rain, and you've got a garden. Wow. That's right. You wanted a garden of your own. Yeah. It'll take years. I might not even see it. But that's okay. Somebody will. Asari think in centuries. Lay a foundation, then step away. Nice Let butt. it grow into something you might never expect. Have mercy, you're cheap, Pathfinder boy. training was my foundation. Gave me a whole galaxy of directions I could go. I don't need someone else's plan. Just a good beginning. The first seeds of a garden. One I started with my friend. What are we planting? What seeds do you have? Desert flowers and grasses from across the Milky Way. Wow. Colors we don't even have names for. Awesome. When they've prepared the ground. Roses. Someday. It's a beautiful game. I love this game. I don't know what the fuck everybody whined about so bad. Excuse me. I love this game. Hey, I love all the Mass Effects. They're all good. It took years to Ready? make. Enjoy it. One. Two. Sweet! A whole bunch of seeds everywhere. Cool. I wonder how long it'll take to, um... Take, I guess. Cool. Look at this guy. Where the hell did he come from? He's massive. Oh, this is awesome. I'm just looking around real quick. I haven't been here in so long. And the environment, you can breathe in. It doesn't kill you anymore. Oh, bug. Let's kill it. Bug, 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 bug. Go get it. We've got hot dogs. Boom, bug. That was overkill. I know. I know. Holy! Did you hear echo? Holy shit! That was loud. Uh oh. separate ways and find them. Hostiles ahead! Damn, they're everywhere, aren't they? Look at them all. Clean shot. There's so many of them. Woo! Back up here. I was wondering why they weren't following. Hey guys, y'all ready? Who's next on our mission? Let's see if we can find Jaw's mission. Jaw. Let's go meet his mama. Fast, whoa. 
Let's go back to Tempest. Back to the ship. We had fun. Ascent is go. Leaving Atmel. All clear. We're gonna go Welcome take Jaw back. back home. Oh, where's Jaw? Jaw. Joel to have roll. We're actually gonna meet his mom. He's really pissed. And so is a Krogan, man. The Krogan's really angry. It was either Salarians or Krogan, and I chose the Salarians because the Krogan have a colony. I even gave him a place on the council and shit, so they shouldn't be too whiny. I wanted to save Salarians. Get over it. Y'all did try to conquer the universe when you're like all ballsy and shit. Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight. Nice. We got baddies, really? Send them in the bushes and see what happens. We've got hot dogs. Enemy is down. Nice. All right. Team, come back. team alright guys here's where we're going to pause it the next episode we're going to meet Jaws mom thanks for coming out to Mixer Epic Tommy 01 where we're playing Adventures of Tom Ryder also known as Mass Effect Andromeda until next time have a great day or night peace out y'all